So hello everybody. So as you can see, it's Friday, it's the end of the week, and I'm here with a bunch of pretty sad stuff. Um, as you can see, the celery, it's pretty drier, a little bit of mold on the, on the onion, a big old leak. It's a little bit of a disaster, but I got this fantastic uh, beef uh, front food from my butcher. It has a lot of tendon and bone, which will make a fantastic broth. So we are going to make what I call the Flintstone broth, kind of primal bone broth, more on the French side, very aromatic. I'm going to use this insane carrot too, which is fun. And I'm going to chop everything up, clean it up, and then we're going to all put it in my favorite pot. This is like such a good pot. And we're going to cook it for seven or eight hours. Yeah, look, also look at my parsley. This is really sad. We're going to just throw everything in and cook it and cook it and to cook it. Um, and I'll see you in a little bit. Uh huh. Yeah, so make sure, see, you really want to look on the back of leaks because this is the part where dirt assembles and you want to make sure that it's all clean and you don't want to have cruddy broth and so we are done processing everything everything is clean got a little bit of malt out of the onion and here we have our herbs we have a little bit of garlic three little cloves that I squished a bit some sage, three cloves, some peppercorn and don't forget your salt also that we'll be putting in. Okay, I think we're ready to assemble everything. And so now that everything is clean, I re-cleaned the leek. We're going to put everything in. So leek, carrots, celery roots. Celery root and clove is what make this broth really French. Italian don't don't do that in their broth. Okay, and uh, the parsley, parsnip, more parsley, the onion, and the real protagonist. Alright, we are set. This is so beautiful. Don't forget your salt. So about, now my hands are dirty, I'll put it in later. Don't forget your salt. In a big pot, two teaspoons, very full. I don't know what this is, like two gallon. Oh, and here are herbs. And I'll see you in a bit. Uh, this will make, uh, we're going to make soup with it, we are going to make um, some, just have some boiled vegetable right from the broth, risotto, tendon salad, that is not for everybody, it's going to be so fantastic. And now, we have put together a beautiful plate with boiled vegetable, a little bit of tendon rice, and pickled onions. Yum!